doTERRA is fucking genius. I mean, between the seven owners, they have 150 years experience with essential oils. That's seven different people's experiences with essential oils and their lifetime is over 150 years, right? Right. So when they master a, a blend, right? They master a blend. They've got like all the years of experience, all their scientists that they hire. And I feel like they're taking all the components because you know how everything is the same thing, really? Yes. Um, and how it's like you're working on chakras. I swear they knew what they were doing. So they created I feel the same way. I was just looking at the blends and I was thinking, which ones am I going to bring forth? Because I know that black pepper, I know that cypress, cinnamon, tangerine, orange, ylang ylang, rose, bergamot, sage, ginger. Those are just a few that are associated with basically balancing and creating pranic energy in your sacral chakra. And I'm looking at all of my blends, like my blossom, my passion. I'm even looking at my on guard and my digest Zen. And they all have at least two or three of these ingredient oils that are great for your sacral chakra. And I, I use these most of the time, like my on guard I've been using since coronavirus, obviously, but I love my digest Zen. It just really soothes my stomach because I, I tend to wake up with like really upset stomach in the mornings for some reason. Ooh. And I've been really good about my diet lately, but sacral chakra, I yeah. know it's the work that I have to do. So just be before you have to wake up with that discomfort, I would suggest before you go to bed, you're setting that intention before you even go to bed. Like I am going to take care of myself before I even feel the pain. Like I'm already, I know that that is something that has been something that happens to me. Yeah. So before I go to bed, I'm going to put the digest down in my stomach and palm on my hand, a few drops of coconut oil. And then I'm going to rub it on my belly clockwise, right? In the Ooh. moment when you're rubbing it on your belly, let me just show you guys. It might be backwards for you guys because remember my pants from last week? I love those pants. Now it's a pantsuit. Pantsuit. <laughs> pants pants to a pantsuit or a, a romper. Yeah, so you're, I, just, you're just bringing that, that sacral chakra. Yeah, dude, it's the only thing I have orange. I was like, well, what am I going to do? I'm going to wear the same thing I wore last week because it's all the things we're talking about. It's You have a highly, highly creative sacral chakra. That's all Thank I got. Girl. Thank you, girl. So what I was going to say, say, girl. So what I was going to say about, um, about uh, doTERRA's genius in creating blends is that they created this emotional line and it's color coded color. What was it? Were we talking about color? So it was like, we get the passion. Oh, oh, where's my camera? Oh, it's over here. It's over here. It's just, there it is. Passion. Yeah. Cheers, girl. Cheers. Cheers. It's one of my favorites. Oh, it is like literally girl. It's, it's, it looks at me and it says, you want to work on the root chakra? Take a sniff of this and let's do this. That's there, what it says. there are so many in here. You can't help yourself. It's just full of good stuff for your sacred chakra. Every ingredient in here is absolutely amazing. Can you read it to and me? I can see why this is really good for your sacred chakra. I mean, this I use it every time I go on a date, and it never fails. You know. Woo! I do it when I when I know my man wants to get it on, because he's like, we're married and we have a kid, so it's like we got to fucking plan that shit. So, <laughs> so he's like, hey, you think you might want? And I was like, I don't know. I got a to-do list for days. Do we got to do this? All right. I'm going to go get my passion and fucking turn it on. One smell at a time. One smell at a time. <laughs> I love it. Oils. Molly just said marriage oh. oil. Shout out for marriage oils, Molly. Marriage oils. Mm -hmm. right I cannot get enough of this passion. I actually <laughs> tried to like recreate a little bit of that here on this other bottle when you came over. And um, I put it a little bit of the citrus bloom in there. It smells. Oh, no. It up. You fucked it up. Oh. It feels just like a holiday cookie, actually. Okay, it's not, yeah. you can't really fuck anything up. It just wasn't quite what you wanted. When the oils are so, I mean, it's not what I wanted. It's something similar, but even better because I almost like to use this only in the winter and in the fall. And I really like the citrus blend in this. And I mean, I don't use it during the daytime because it obviously has citrus. I've learned. Oh, no, you could still no, so this is a thing I don't want to, and I love that you brought this up because I don't want to make people afraid that they, they not to use the citrus during the day because citrus and daytime are like, if you wake up and you're in a sad, shitty mood, let me get my wild orange. You smell them. I just don't want to put them on my skin and go outside. No, but you can still, what about your hairline? What my hairline, I can put it on my clothes. I can put it on my collar line. I've been using it on my wrist because the inside yeah. of my wrist. Yeah. When are you like, oh, hey, son, come and get my wrist. You don't do that. 